Good morning, everyone. It's Pastor Tim Hammy, First Assembly of God in Burlington, Kansas. And uh, this, uh, this is February 1st. Welcome to uh, the month that where you're supposed to share, show love to your loved ones. Um, Deuteronomy 6, 4, and 5 is what we're looking at this morning. It says, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love, the, love your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength. But that was an amazing uh, statement. Um, love the, you love your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength. You see, when you're truly committed to something, you're going to put all your energy into it. Unfortunately, in this day and age, um, people are committed to so many things. They're not focusing on one thing. Committed to... Um, this and that, committed to um, so many different ideas, serving this item, serving that item, well, putting God first in your life, putting Him first in your life, loving your, loving the Lord your God with all your soul, mind, your heart, and your strength is very important. And so, as you put God first in your life, as you put God first in, in everything that you do, and uh, it wasn't a question, it was a statement. He, as you see in Deuteronomy, he says, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your strength. It's saying, hey, everything you are, Every part of you. Love God with all of you. So, as this is a Bible study, um, get out your notebook, write out the verse, Deuteronomy 6, 4, and 5, where it says, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. Love your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength. And then you put an O and you observe it. A, and then you apply it to your life, and then you pray. Well, before I uh, uh, pray for you guys today, um, it is Wednesday, and I'd like to invite you to church tonight. Um, we are studying prayer on Wednesday night for the adults. Youth group is doing uh, their thing in the back, and the kids are doing stuff down in the basement, and, and it's a great time of uh, bringing the family together. Um, call it family night but one of my kids go dad you call it family night but we don't really do anything as family we got our we go to our own stuff so just praying about it and oasis sounds like a good name because it's a place of, of refreshing before you finish out the week so so come out on wednesday night to uh, really get refreshed it starts at 6 30 uh, goes to about 7 30 and it's a great time, corner of 9th and Yuba here in Berlin and Kansas. would love to have you come out and join us. God has something good to say to you. So, God bless you. Let me pray over your day. It is February 1st. Uh, and let me pray for you. Lord, I thank you for all those who are going to watch. I pray that you bless them, Lord. Encourage them. Give them a great Tuesday or Wednesday. And Lord God, give them, uh, just bless their day, Lord, as they go through it, Lord. And thank you for them, Lord, in your name. Amen. Hey, love you guys. Hope you have a wonderful Wednesday and uh, blessings on you. Encourage you in, in the Lord and uh, be a blessing to someone that you come in contact with today. Get, pray that you have the opportunity to share the Lord with somebody today. Have a great day. Love you guys. See you tomorrow.